Hi, Cardinalis again for Green Tech Heat Solutions, and today I'm gonna give you a big tip on proper ducting. Yeah, you know these guys are friends from the Titan system. Well, in order to do a proper propane job, you need to get the heat from the Titan system in the proper area, but in order to do that, you need to put ducting everywhere in the house. Now, this isn't an exact science, but there definitely are some guidelines that you're gonna want to adhere to that experienced guys have a second nature, but sometimes first guys struggle with, okay? Now, a couple of rules of thumb. First off, straight is great. Whenever you can, try and get your ducting as straight as possible. However, if you have to come around a corner, try and do that corner as gradually as you can. If you ever are tempted to put a 90 degree bend inside of your ducting, fight that temptation. Try and come onto the opposite side of the door and then gradually come around that corner so there's a much more gradual bend in the duct. The reason why this is so important is because you lose anywhere between one and seven degrees of heat every time there's a bend. Depending on ambient temperature, depending on the number of heat sinks in the room, depending on how much propane you're burning and a bunch of other factors, you are going to lose anywhere between one and seven degrees of heat in certain types of bends. So if ever possible, and you need to put a lot of bends in your ducting, make sure they're gradual. Also, sometimes if you need to go up into a second story, like I'll be able to show you here, it's a good idea whenever possible not to just have a big right angle in the ducting, but if you can, try and lift up slightly the propane heater. Try and lift up that Titan so you just slowly take off maybe 15 or 20 degrees from that bend. It seems like a small thing, but that little additional angle will actually help get an extra two or three degrees of efficiency out of your Titan system. Also, when you're ducting properly, as I showed you in previous tips, make sure whenever you can that you put a nice folded moving blanket underneath the ducting wherever it's going to touch nice wood flooring so you don't hurt or damage the flooring. When in doubt, just remember the most grand and gradual bend possible and you will have ducted the house properly.